At Zaxby's, we don't just make chicken fingers. We make the most premium tenderloin. 12-hour marinated, hand-breaded, fried to golden perfection. Deserves not one, not two, not even three, but your choice of 12 dipping sauces chicken fingers. Chicken fingers that you can dip, dunk, or drizzle in ranch. And Zach sauce. And spicy Zach sauce. And honey mustard. And tongue torch. And barbecue. And I'm out of time. Woo, saucy. Zaxby's. Long David Bowie, it's Heroes. 2.9 WBLM. We send that one out to four heroes this morning. State Trooper Jake Mowry, State Trooper Shane St. Pierre, Trooper Dakota Stort, and State Trooper David Lemieux. Those are the four troopers who were plowed into yes. Sunday night at Hollis on 202. How no one got killed. It, it's unbelievable. It, or that the other people that were with them, standing with them, right. weren't hurt either. I mean, it was oh, so well, terrifying. So sending uh, our best out to uh, our state, four state troopers there. Two are still hospitalized. Uh, they're going to be out for a, a while, and rightfully so. It's a yeah. good reminder of what our what our uh, first responders are up to. Just not even like dealing. They were dealing with a family situation sitting at the end of a driveway. Right. Just not alone even dealing with stuff like that, but just like... Being open to what happened, yeah. being run over by uh, incapacitated, alleg- allegedly incapacitated drivers. So, anyway, get better. Thanks for what you do. Um, it also gives the uh, uh, there's a huge shortage of state troopers. They're like fifty troopers short right now. And now we're down four. Down, which is sign- <laughs> so right? that's significant. So if you got- so if you're looking for a new gig, um, and you want to like. Make your neighbors feel safe, right? And you know, take care of us. Then please look into law enforcement. And uh, if Main State Troopers, if you guys need any filling, Celeste and I, we're done at be 10. happy to. 10. I'm just not a very fast driver. No, no, that's we're, that's the only the only no, we're not good drawback about pretty much any me. of I'm not those. Very things. good at the fast driving. We get lost a lot, and um... I do get lost a lot. <laughs> and what is up with my GPS sending me to the wrong places lately? Oh, really? Oh, my GPS is just a son of a bitch. <laughs> so uh, you, so it you. does. I'm like, wait a minute. I'm supposed to be going north. Why is it bringing me to Scarborough? Are you sure you're not putting it something in wrong? I don't know if I made it mad. Is it, I know, but are you, are you inputting the correct information? Yes. Okay. It's so silly that you would think something like that. <laughs> I love that you're swearing at your GPS. <laughs> As, you know, remember the old, uh, still, it's an upgrade from the old days when maps and trip Map ticks. quest and, and trying to get, you know what I did when Mark and I were dating and I have no sense of direction. I, I got that from my aunt Julie, God rest her soul. But uh, we were dating and he, I was supposed to meet him at a ski place, right? I was working. He's like, meet me there. And he's like, okay, you, you go here and here, 295, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, okay. So I went to 95 and I started driving on 95 and things didn't seem right. And so I stopped at this convenience store and I was supposed to be on 295. Right. Not go 295. Right. You're in Orno. and you- I was on 95. Right. I should have been on 295. It was, oh my gosh. No, you, uh, no. That was just classic. We, back in the day, if we had an event. That oh. started at one. We would I'd have, have to, to leave on the Wednesday before. We'd say, say it happens. It starts at eleven. Mm. Celeste, hoping she would get there by twelve thirty. And sometimes I did, and sometimes I didn't. And now, you, now it's just <laughs> sometimes. You and didn't. it was before cell phones, so I couldn't even call and say I'm lost, right, or I'm late, or anything. It was oh, it was horrible. We can't be state troopers. No, we're not. Never mind. Wheel, I'm sorry. Wheel of Meat's coming up. It's the captain and Celeste. Your morning rocks on BLM. It's WBLM playing a little game we like to call Wheel, Wheel of Meat. Hello. Hi. 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 How's it going? It's going well. How about you? You know what? I'm doing great today. <laughs> Very excited. I got a good night's sleep last night, and now I'm all fired up. <laughs> Perfect. Who is this? This is Julie. Julie, it's good to have you. What are you doing this morning? I'm working. All right. Julie, good to have you here. Today's topic is bees. What's on the wheel for our friend Julie today? Well, you know what? I just realized this uh, is that I went a little pork heavy on the wheel today. You know, it happens sometimes. (laughs) Is that Uh, okay? Yeah, that's fine. 
Okay, so we've got a slab of pork belly up there. Yes. A boneless pork roast. A full mm-hmm. rack of house-smoked pork ribs, which are mm, chef's kiss. <laughs> then we move along to a little bit of beef. We've got a ribeye and a skirt steak, too. But um, I'm kind of thinking you're probably going to get some pork. You're going to get some we'll pork see. here. All right, let's spin that wheel. Through. There we go. All right. Well, you got Very a strong, strong arm. Here we go, and there we go. We go. Uh, well, uh, let uh, me uh. guess. It's pork. It is. It's the full rack <laughs> of house rack? smoked pork ribs. Oh, yes. Perfect. That sounds All right, now you just have to win it. Oh, I, she's going to do this. Today's top- I'll give it a shot. Today's right. topic are bees. Are you ready? I Be- hate them. Uh, we know bees make honey. Julie, do bees eat honey? True or false? Bees eat honey. Um, I'm going to... See, that's just... I don't know. I'm going to say... True? It's true. Yes, they do. They do. There's a dirty joke in there. We're not going to do it. I can see Celeste <laughs> looking at me. I'm waving her I'm off. I'm not saying it. I'm not. I'm not. True or false, Julie, a bee would only need two tablespoons of honey to fly all the way around this world of ours. Two tablespoons um, of honey gets them all the way around the like world. Bee cocaine or something? I right. don't know. I'm going to say false it, on that one. It is true. Oh. Yeah. Wow. Would they live long enough? I mean, how long do bees live? That's too long. Too long. We, not a fan here. Yeah. You no, really... no, no, no. I'm petrified of bees and hornets and wasps and anything like that. What bee did you wrong? <laughs> Who hurt you? What happened? A wasp. A wasp. Wasp did her wrong. How old were you? Oh, I was just a kid, but I remember it like it was yesterday. You should talk to somebody about this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I'm good. I'm good. I don't want you to carry this through the rest of your life, honey. <laughs> you know what? Well, you- it's, it's, not, it's, it's been 53 years, so, so we're, you you're know, just living it with is it. What it is. Not too late to do the hard work to get you on the other side <laughs> of this. Right. Okay? Yeah. Um, we have one more question. You got one right, you got one wrong. Oh, that's right. We're playing. Okay. Bee's sense of smell, the sense of smell of a bee, is 50 times greater than the sense of smell for a dog. I'm going to say true on that. You would be absolutely correct with that. Yeah. Wow. You know a lot about bees. Look, you have taken... You know your enemy. You have taken it back, though. You have taken your hatred for me. What that wasp did for you 53 years ago, you have taken it back today. And we're going to reward you with a rack of pork. Perfect. Oh, my my gosh. gosh. Some sort of, like, pork therapy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Get your bee phobia. Yes. (laughs) All right. Get back to work today and know that you are a big winner and a healthier human being. Here on Say It With Us. Wheel of Me. ZZ Top for the 343rd millionth time to Blimpville. Hampton Beach Casino Ballroom tonight. Last time I saw him a couple years ago over at uh, Merrill, it was a great night, and yeah. um, they mean a lot to us. They opened our Civic Center in 1977 here in Portland. Uh, and Didn't they play one of our birthday parties? Number three. 30. Okay. That was 20 years ago. Oh, that, that's why I wasn't sure anymore. Oh, my kind God. Kind of a blur. I'm so old. 20 but years ago. They love New England, and um, they've been so good to us, and and um, and Reverend Billy and Frank and Dusty, we miss you. Uh, Hampton Beach tonight. If you've never seen a man, you're going to see some... You're going to see some legends right there. Yep. You're going to see Jimi Hendrix's favorite guitar player, Billy Gibbons. That's amazing. Right? Yeah. When Hendrix says, that's my guy. That's Jeez. all right. Uh, so if you're going to the show tonight, you'll have to answer these questions for entry. This is this is just how this it is. This is how it is, if, right? If you've yeah. never been before, mm-hmm. they stop you at the door and they'll ask you. And we'll get, we're going to help you out. Uh, if the band is at a red light, they are what? ZZ Stop. That's right. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um. If the band has a day off and goes to the mall, they are? ZZ Shop. That's correct. Okay, okay. Um, If the band feels like a Sprite or a Pepsi. ZZ Pop. You're on it. If the band wants to clean the floor real good. ZZ Mop. Right. Oh, this is fun. Okay, keep going. If the band all dressed as their favorite village person. If the band. ZZ Cop. Yes. (laughs) 
Oh, my God. Or ZZ Indian. No. Or Native American. No. That was my favorite one. If the band was in a movie that did horrible at the box office. Oh, ZZ Flop. God, you're good. God, I'm so good. If the band was a pork sandwich. <laughs> if the band was a pork, a pork sandwich. sandwich. Yes. Yeah. Think Wheel of Me. ZZ Chop. Yes. Really? Yes. <laughs> That's a bad one. Okay. If the band look, it was it's early. <laughs> if the band flies direct from Lagrange, Maine to Lagrange, Texas, they go ZZ nonstop. Yes. <laughs> All right, now I'm scraping the barrel of the. Oh, really? The now you are. <laughs> hey, if the band has a soft spot for shelter animals, they are ZZ adopt. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh, my God. I am so good at rhyming. I should start writing rap lyrics. Yeah, okay. Uh, ZZ Native American. <laughs> right on it. It didn't today. rhyme, but that was my favorite village uh, person. What is that smell? Oh, it's pumpkin spice. Mm. It's everywhere. It's in, that's, that's why we're, that's why we've been, our noses are running and we've yeah, been sneezing. sneezing, coughing. We're like, what is that? There's some kind of allergen in the air. It must be Ugh, pumpkin spice. I'm going to break out in hives pretty soon. <laughs> I'm on a pumpkin spice lobster. Is that such a thing? Can we get that going? It's a, it's amazing. There are now pumpkin spice. We're not kidding you. This isn't a, a silly little thing we made up because we do do that, but this isn't that. Pumpkin, no. pumpkin spice butt wipes are now a thing that actually exists. Mm -hmm. It's a company, Celeste, called Dude Wipes are selling them under the name Dumpkin Spice. Oh, 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 that's so bad. Yeah. Dumpkin Spice. Yes. It says, keep your butt cozy with a pumpkin spice inspired mix of clove, nutmeg, and other fall scents. No, no, nothing oh, like boy. that is going anywhere near that. Clove, eh? Or nutmeg. And nutmeg, huh? No, no. jeez. Oh, the company joked about doing this a couple years back. Um, they did a fake photo of pumpkin spice butt wipes a couple years ago. But, of course, we all went crazy during the pandemic. So now we're now like... They, now they exist. Now we're like, yeah. Yeah, that's something that I would buy. Because we all went insane. Dumpkin spice wipes. So be looking for that. Maybe we'll buy some and give them away. I was just thinking that these would be really fun to put in Christmas stockings, like for, just kind of funny. Joke. Oh, you're the queen of the joke gift. Yeah. You're the queen of that kind of stuff. You're the guy, you're the person that gave me the Kentucky Fried Chicken uh, scented oh, yeah. log. That's right. Yes. It's like a, a, what do you call those? Instant log things. Right. But it, it's uh, from Kentucky Fried Chicken and it smells like Kentucky Fried Chicken. It smells like Kentucky Fried when Chicken. When you burn it. Yeah. Right. And so we burned it at camp and animals came from hundreds of miles around. <laughs> so I wanted to thank you for that. Now you have bears. Yeah, bears. We have moose. We have neighbors. You know. Oh, sorry. No, that's what happens on the unorganized territories of South Oxford. Anything goes, man. So, But now I'm going to be getting pumpkin spice butt wipes from Celeste uh -huh. for this holiday season. So Ordering them now. Uh, Dumpkin spice wipes. Uh, ask for them by name george thoroughgood gear jamma it's 102.9 wblm that's some straight ahead hard work and american rock and roll music yeah yeah get your day going for you hard work and americans we work harder man than most countries 25 percent. we work more than 25 percent of people in germany we work harder than everybody in the world except people in mexico yeah and we're in maine and we're so in we're, maine. we work harder than most of the people in our country well there's a new so. po new poll out about hard working people and they looked at all kinds of things, uh, your commute time, your employment rate. Meals that you've missed. Hours worked, how much free time you have. Little it, league games you've had to miss. And I'm calling <laughs> BS on this because it has us in the middle of the pack. No way. We're up at the top. Right? Yeah. Hardest working state, North Dakota, which probably makes sense. Yeah. Alaska's number two. South Dakota. Nebraska, Wyoming, Texas. Where's New Hampshire? New Hampshire is like t t 10? No, New Hampshire is 15. It's like all those farmlands and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, that, you know, that kind of makes sense. We're 25 in between Montana, which sounds like a pretty hardy, hardworking state, uh -huh. and South Carolina. What do they do in South Carolina? Crawfish? I don't know. They do, do some do farm. There's, I guess it's very rural. Huh. 
Um, at the bottom is New Mexico. New York is number 49. West Virginia and Michigan. But we're kind of in the middle of the pack. I call BS on that. This is a hardworking crew, man. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we get, we do, we're rural, so we do have tons of farmland. We got our you know guys cutting down trees. We got men and women fishing for lobster. I mean, come yeah. on. Yeah, yeah. Call them BS on People them. getting up early in the morning to talk on the radio. That is hard work. Hard work. No. Talk about the Super Bowl. There is a talk of maybe Taylor Swift doing it, but she's like, I'm not paying to be in the Super yeah. Bowl <laughs> halftime show. She's like, well, no, you could pay me to do that. Which they should. They should pay artists. It's ridiculous that they have the artists pay for the, their production and stuff. It's like, no, man, they the Super Bowl makes so much money, and these artists are such a huge draw. Right. So now the governor... They don't need you, Super Bowl. It's going to be in uh, Vegas, and now the Nevada governor is putting out a plea. Back in black, I hit the sack. It's been too long. I'm glad to be back. He went to ACTC. <laughs> we haven't had a good rock act at the Super Bowl since 2010 when The Who played. We had a good round there with the Stones and Petty and Springsteen. Mm-hmm. Let's get ACDC to play the Super Bowl. That but, would be cool. But we know those guys, and they don't get out of bed. They don't do a thing they don't want to do. They don't care. And they don't care about American they want, football. They want to get, get paid, man. We know yeah. those guys. Um, so could ACDC, don't fall for the hype. I don't. I mean, I'd be all for it. We're all for it. We would love ACDC to play that if it's going to be Vegas. I don't know if it's going to happen, though. That would be crazy. Oh, my gosh. More of that rock news up on uh, the WBLM app and at WBLM.com.